This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Look at, man, she is powerfully strong. Yes, she is. Legit. No joke, man. She likes to tussle and she, uh, I tell you what's great about Nyla is she brings such parody to the matches, you know, because Sasha Banks is, uh, is not, a, is not a large person, right? You know, she's probably uh low hundred and something. So mm -hmm. I don't know, 110, 120. Uh, and meanwhile, Nyla is more than that. And the height difference, the weight difference, just the size, it's a natural story where she is sort of, she is to the ladies, what a Vader or a Sid vicious or, right. uh, a bam, bam, Bigelow was right. Exactly. Except obviously much more attractive, right? Which, you know, now that you think about it, Roman reigns related to the rock, Nyla Jax related to the rock. And it's pretty well documented that most every woman on earth considers the rock, the best looking man in the world. Mm hmm. I, I don't, what, I don't I, think this bloodline is capable of making ugly people. Hmm. Yeah. The, uh, you're right. Very handsome. We should really test that theory and see if Nyla could have your baby. Oh, please. And then we could find out because there finally be an attractive Shivani. <laughs> is that, will that be possible? <laughs> Matt Shivani would be pissed. <laughs> I could have looked like the rock, but I look like this. <laughs> what the fuck? Chris Shivani would be cutting promos left and right. <laughs> this is bullshit. Oh, God. Uh, where would my life be without your bullshit? What bullshit? Yes. Dude, tell, tell me you wouldn't want to wake up tomorrow and look a little bit more like The Rock. Well, I think everybody would. Well, that's what I'm saying. Right. So when your kids want that, you know, that means they're bad people? No, it means they're smart. <laughs> if I could look more like The Rock and less like Tony Schiavone, sign me the fuck up. <laughs> Look at this. Pretty good finish here. Or attempt well, I hope to it's finish. not a finish. Come on, Naya. Come on. Kick your ass, Naya. But I mean, she's doing a great job of selling it. And got to get you out here tussling. Some of the fans kind of pop for it. And Sasha really fighting hard. Man. Ooh, fuck. Tell you, I love the purple hair, man. Love the purple hair. I do. I, I like her purple hair, too. I really do. Well, I, I like I like when I like when when women have color in their hair, you know, different different colors in their hair. I'm just into that. I think it looks cool. Look at this man. Just <laughs> this is what you call ragdolling her right now. Ragdolling. Ragdolling. There you go, Sasha. Roll her up. One, two, three. My God, she pinned her. Great reaction shot. Great reaction shot of Nyla. Naya. That's too close together. Yeah. Yeah. Because it just happened a minute ago where I was explaining to Megan that you might want to tussle with Naya, and she thought I was saying Nyla. Right. Which, as we remember from Double or Nothing, you really did want to tussle with her. Hmm. By the way, what do you think a few weeks ago when Nyla beat the shit out of Riho? I thought it was a great match. And became the champ. Great match. JR referred to her as King of the Mountain. Yeah. It's a, it's a fucking expression. That's exactly what it and is. And the internet got all furious about it, but I mean, come on. I don't think the internet got all furious about it. I think a bunch of jack offs who shouldn't be on social media got all furious about it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, listen, well, if you were, if you were furious about that, which is a term, it's not a knock on Nyla. It's not a knock on her sexuality. Not at all. Not Here's at the all. Thing, when I heard it, I didn't think anything. Of I, it. It, I didn't, it didn't come. It didn't. Usually I have a pretty good radar about stuff that's said that may be questionable. It didn't bother me at all. And, no. and then I, then I was told afterwards that some people are upset about it. If you are one that was upset about him saying that, here's my suggestion to you. Delete your account. Go back to your regular life and leave social media to people who have brains because you don't have any. Well, there you see. Uh 
Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.